racist letters left on cars in Midtown overnight. And now some are questioning whether or not the hate speech is crossing the line into hate crime. Fox 40's Nicole Comstock spoke with police and community members. She joins us live tonight from Midtown. Nicole? Yeah, Ty and Stephanie, people who found these letters on their cars are disturbed. Some of them are even scared, but there are still plenty of people who haven't come out to their cars yet to find that they got this surprise hate mail. You can still see them tonight all down O Street in Midtown. And although the message inside of these seems to be encouraging violence, the Sacramento Police Department says this is not necessarily a hate crime. At first glance, they might look like parking tickets tucked under windshield wipers. But sometime overnight, dozens of cars in Midtown were outfitted with racist leaflets. They mention white genocide, exterminating Muslims and Mexicans, and reads, if you have not secured a body dump site, do so now. Kidnap, rob, and torture. Look at this racism still going on, and who would have thought? This is crazy. Even though the rhetoric is considered hate speech and aggressive hate speech at that, Sacramento police say it doesn't necessarily constitute a hate crime. The First Amendment does uh, protect the right to free speech, um, even if that speech is deplorable or despicable. Officer Matthew McPhail says police are investigating who left these leaflets and why, but the act in and of itself is not a crime. Trying to determine if there is a crime that is associated with the distribution. Well, I hope they don't wait till it is. Linda Contreras found the letter on her car this morning. She says just talking about it makes her emotional. You know, my, my mother is right there. She, she's elderly in. But some say the anti Muslim language in this letter has far reaching consequences. And unfortunately, with this increased political rhetoric um, of attacking immigrants, Mexicans, Latinos, and, and Muslims, we're seeing an uptick in incidents around the country. Bassem El Cara with the Council on American Islamic Relations says this leaflet seems to be fueled by one person's bigotry and doesn't reflect the community in Midtown. But we hope we've moved past, uh, you know, that era. As of now, no word on who passed these out. Copies are signed Greg Withrow, a well-known white supremacist who grew up in Sacramento and has been vocal in the media since the 70s. Calls to his last known numbers went unreturned. He going to guarantee get some followers because there's a lot of hate in this world. Now, again, these letters were found on O Street and J Street in Midtown, and police are hoping that maybe one of the local businesses or homeowners has surveillance video of whoever passed these out overnight. If you think you might have that, contact the Sacramento Police Department. In Midtown tonight, Nicole Comstock, Fox 40 News. Thanks a lot, Nicole.